。我相信，我也跟很多的海南人一样，一直在关注海南淄博港的建设的发展。尤其的话呢，我有一个感觉，现在就是说，高新技术方面的投资，嗯，大大增长。我也从中感受到大家那种奋发的这种动力，大家都在拧成一股绳，在奋力的建设我们这个美好的自贸港。因为毕竟有自贸港的这个政策的扶持，而自贸港呢对人才的重视，注入了一个强心剂，嗯，让我们更有信心了。五年来，东方石化实现了汽油和柴油的出口，顺利的把产品投放到了东南亚的市场。在五年来，伴随着海南自由贸易港的建设，我们的载人深潜技术以及深海无人智能技术都得到了全面的发展。自贸港五年了，五年前我们宝良村还是一个空心村，大家都搬走了。现在的宝良村已经成为一个一个网红村。经过我们这帮青年返乡创业的五年奋斗，咖啡为特色，发展乡村旅游，带动乡村旅游产业发展。相信我们海南自贸港乡村振兴的未来前途无量。我喜欢你。Hainan Province of China covers an area of 35,400 square kilometers, but it has jurisdiction over about 2 million square kilometers of sea area. In April 2018, China announced to the world. The project to build Hainan Free Trade Port. High-tech industry is one of the four leading industries in the modern industrial system of Hainan Free Trade Port. Hainan has been riding the wave. In the surging waves of high and new technology lies the future of Hainan. Deng Yu Jing is an ocean nought. She came to Hainan in the year when China announced the construction of Hainan Free Trade Port to the world. I was in 18th January, and I was in the year of the year. 对，到现在为止应该有四年半，快五年的时间了。那就是奋斗者号载人潜水器啊，我平时工作的一台设备。然后它的长呢，大概有十米，高有四米多，宽三米多。所以说它这么大的体积呢，决定了它重量是非常的大的，它有三十几吨。Institute of Deep Sea Science and Engineering is where Deng Yu Jing works. It was co-established by Hainan Province. Sanya City and Chinese Academy of Sciences, and serves as a national base committed to deep sea scientific research. Based in Sanya, Hainan, the exploration of the deep blue sea area has never ceased. In November 2020, the manned submersible Striver landed on the bottom of 10,000 meter deep Mariana Trench. In August 2022, researchers at IDSSE successfully set up a large depth in situ scientific experimental station on the seabed, which will realize long term unmanned scientific research in deep sea. In 2021, Deng Yu Jing, as the chief pilot of Striver, completed her first 10,000 meter deep dive in Mariana Trench. 那次下潜，它并不是一次我们理解的常规的科学考察，那次更多的是一次工程应用，一个无人设备，它被困在了万米的海底，它不能自主的浮上来。然后呢，就是我们就是我们的载人潜水器需要下去对它实施一个相当于营救，就是把它营救上来。所以说那个潜次呢，也是我第一次下万米，也是我第一次在奋斗者当主驾驶。On October 6, 2022, Dan and the manned submersible Striver once again set off from Sanya and headed towards the deep sea. The voyage lasted 157 days and covered more than 22,000 nautical miles around Oceania. 
the scientific research kicked off, the Global Deep Sea Scientific Exploration Mission. For the first time, humans set foot on Diamantina Trench in the Southeast Indian Ocean and conducted observation and sampling, ushering a new chapter of international cooperation and manned deep diving of the Striver. That also makes Dung the first woman in human history to reach the deepest part of Kurmandek Trench in the Southwest Pacific Ocean. We should have completed 66 times, but in the middle of the ocean, it is very a In five years, Deng Yuqing has grown from an intern oceanaut to a senior oceanaut. She has witnessed the majestic power of core technologies in deep sea exploration and the rise of Hainan as a brand new deep sea sci tech pace setter. Nebiana 我们非常期望我们的深海科考码头能够尽快地建成这样我们就可以去邀请全世界的深海科学家都加入到我们的载人生前队伍全球总共有三十七条深渊其中万米级的有五条但是我们对这些深渊的研究还非常非常有限所以
launching a rocket upon its delivery will soon be reality. Wen Chai Aerospace Supercomputing Center is an important part of the construction of aerospace big data industry chain of Wen Chang International Aerospace City. It aims for whole life cycle connectivity in aerospace big data chain with airborne photography, ground data collection, cloud storage, supercomputing, quantum transmission and available for both government and companies to provide scientific and technological support for the development of aerospace. On February 27, 2022, the Long March 8 Remote 2 carrier rocket carried 22 artificial satellites and successfully launched 22 satellites into the space. That is the first commercial space launch in Wenchang Space Launch Site. The mission also carried the largest number of satellites at one time in China. Hainan has given full play to its advantages in temperature, depth and dimension. Three scientific and technological innovation hubs have been built in southern breeding, deep sea and aerospace. Meanwhile, major technological infrastructure and platforms are also in the making. Empowered by high-tech technology, the Hainan Free Trade Port is striding forward towards high-quality development. As one of the leading industries in Hainan Free Trade Port, high-tech industry is a cornerstone for high-quality development. Hainan has made steady progress in high-tech innovation. In the future, Hainan will set sail again to ride the wave and blaze new trails.